It's a different life. Women and women have a totally different concept of what's exciting in the bedroom than guys. My wife's like, uh, she buys this sex game book that was written by some angry lady, and uh, <laughs> yeah, no guy would do this to another guy. Here's a game, the housewife in the window washer. I'll be the housewife, you'll be the window washer, I'll be in the bedroom getting undressed, you'll be outside the bedroom washing the window. Yeah, you want me to wash the window? Just tell me to wash the fucking window. You sure this book isn't called How to Trick Your Husband Into Doing Shit Around the House? It's gonna be exciting, Bob. I'll be in there getting undressed, you'll be washing the window, you're gonna get turned on, take your dick out, start jerking off. Yeah, I don't need you for that. <laughs> start jerking off? Well, not by the window I just washed. <laughs> but it is exciting when the police pull up. Because they don't know you're playing that game. So, to them, it looks like a guy masturbating outside of somebody's bedroom window. She said, here's something I'll try. My girlfriend did this with her husband. I'll get dressed up real sexy. You take me out to a bar. I'll go in first, then you come in, but you act like you don't know me. So I go in this place, sit at the bar, buy this girl a drink, we're talking, and my wife comes over and goes, what do you think you're doing? I said, who the fuck are you? So I figured, here's what I'll do. I'll just do her first and get her all revved up and everything, and then maybe she'll reciprocate. And that's one of the disadvantages of having a positive attitude. 